Good afternoon, everyone. Thank you, as always, for tuning in to Public Freakouts Unleashed. We have a little something different for you today. So I have compiled the 13 most ridiculous public freakouts that I could find, and I mean truly ridiculous. But instead of telling these stories in any just random old order, I thought I would stack them from 13 to 1 just to build some suspense. So this guy right here is chewing out the woman who's recording this video because she is parked in a handicapped spot while she tries to pick her kids up from school. Hello, boo. Hi, buddy. Excuse me? Because my son is 10 years old and my daughter is 12. And my daughter's been going here since preschool and she's 12 now. And the relevance of that? You asked me why am I here? Because this is my option and I've talked to the, the parking patrol out here. Yes. You've been given permission. Do you to see any door. handicap open? You've been given permission. You're no, not I've. You're not handicapped. My mother is. She's you're right not. there. You're not. She's you're right not. over but there. Give permission to park in the red zone. Okay, and I've talked to the parking people before, and they haven't given me a ticket in all this time. Oh really? No. Okay, well that's about. To they change. never have. Okay. Oh, so you're threatening me now? I'm threatening you. Okay, great. Great. Yeah, I can't wait to show this to the principal. So move your car. I'm not moving my move car. Okay. I'm not. Okay. Well, then get a ticket. I'm not getting one now. Get a ticket. I'm not getting one now, but this is going to go on YouTube. This is going to oh, go to the good, principal. Good, this is going to go on Facebook. This is going to go on the okay. community Welcome page. This is going to go to Welcome the community to center's page to about a threatening male filming Welcome children outside. Coming in at 12th place, this guy who lives in this residential apartment complex decided it was way too early in the morning for this. Are you leaving me? Coming in at number 11, I don't know what was in this lady's bag, but it was heavy. That's for sure. Disclaimer, no one was actually harmed during this outburst. Well, coming in at the coveted number 10 spot, this woman right here, an Australian lady, I'm not sure if this is actually Australia, but I've never seen a Hungry Jack's anywhere in America. Anyway, this lady ordered a pork belly sandwich and she decided to get out of her, that's not her car by the way, she got out of her car to come up to the window barefoot, you'll notice, because she was so unbelievably upset by the fact that this sandwich did not look like it did in the commercial. What a pork belly. Deluxe looks like on the TV. All your photos are out the front there for that matter. Disgusting is what it was. It's all fat. It's got this much pork in the middle underneath the tomato. Because the second try to you had, the second one, well, first one wasn't bad enough, the second one came back from the microwave. $13 and whatever sense. I don't care what to say. Nine dollars. I'm gonna bring out the big cup. See, I'm gonna love this. No one cares. I don't care what you're saying, pal. And just for you, I might hold you up a little bit more. I don't, I've got nowhere to be. I'm going to know what to do. I'll speak to anybody how I like. My day I'll off, you dummy. I ordered one of those burgers on the thing that's not like this. If I had my camera, I'd take a picture and I'd show you for it. How's that right I'm not going to listen to you. Oh, you're not going to listen to me. Get out of the drive-thru. I have asked you nicely. I asked nicely for the pork belly. I asked nicely for the second pork belly. If you think that I'm going to ask you nicely for a third one, you got another thing coming. And I'm a swearer. I haven't sworn at you yet. At number nine, this lady seems to have bit off more than she could chew when she gets a little sassy with the employee at this, I, I think it's a Taco Bell, she's dressed for McDonald's, but this is a Taco Bell. Mm-hmm. I'm so sorry. No, you're not. Thank you. You're right, I'm not. LOL. 
Lol. That's why you're pathetic and work over here. You're right. I'm so pathetic. Well, obviously, because you don't have to right. take care of the people inside right. the restaurant. Yeah. If someone orders, they wait 22 minutes for a reason. They should fire me. They fire me. Man, you're, you're, and what was your name again? Marley. 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 M A R L E Y. Is it M A R L E Y? Yes. Yeah. What are you talking? Why is writing Yelp? When someone Bye. in the restaurant's eating, you give them their food first, not to the DoorDash. Bye. Bye, Felicia. Have a nice day. You too, raggedy bitch. Yup. Yeah. Yeah. Being rude. Don't be rude to your customers. That's why you can't get nothing right in the restaurant. Um, you're cute arguing with a high schooler. Oh, well, that's cool. You're a high schooler. Yep. Yep. Shows that shows yep. your demeanor. Yep. Okay. Okay. Exactly. Yes. Well, we're really starting to get into the meat here, folks. This guy brandishes his mace canister at some Winco employees because he claims that everyone is getting too close to him. It is still on floor. It's starting. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Stop. Get away. I'll walk you here. You my life. You don't need to do that. You don't uh, need to do this. Yeah. Should I stop them? You stay away, sir. Stay away. I'm not going to hear you. Here you are. You're a man. Is that your friend? Yes. Okay. Sir, I need you to put sir. that away. We're in a public place right now. Yep. Yeah. You stay away. I'm going to stay away. Thank you. You can't be That's threatening people in here asshole. with pepper spray, okay? You understand that? Pepper spray. No, you cannot threaten people in here with pepper spray. You're not a cop, you're not a lawyer. I don't need your spray. Uh-oh. Not all of them. Coming in at number six, we are thrown directly into the middle of a high-octane confrontation between this woman and her landlord, who appears to live directly above her. Always a terrible idea. We get a sneak peek into what appears to be the climax of months of building tension. Never touch my stuff. Why were they in front of my door? Never. They don't put them in front of my door. Never. Don't put them in front of my door. Never. Don't put them in front of my door. Don't put them in front of my door. Did you hear me? Don't put them in front of my door. Did you hear me? What are you gonna do? Did you hear me? What are you gonna do? You gonna move out very soon. I am waiting for that. That's good to know. Okay. That's good to know. Move don't put out. your stuff. I'm not leaving oh, until January. I'm, I'm not tomorrow. leaving until January 31st. They call me all January 31st, I am out of here. I you already know go. that. I you already go. know. You, know the you already you know. know. January 31st. You know what? January 31st, I have to leave. January 31st, I have to leave. You know what? I'm not all done. You're, January 31st, you're you don't have any of my IDs. What are you talking about? Why are yeah, you threatening you, me? You know what? I, give I don't you care. I don't care. I give you an you, didn't even, you didn't even I, bring me to court for the right thing. I, you I, idiot. I, you I, didn't bring me to court I, for the I, right I, thing. He dismissed I everything. I took the picture. I took the everything. Oh my everything, god. Everything. That is great. You're gonna. Oh my god. You see, gonna, so you. So this is why you're coming you, down here you, lying to the police saying my boyfriend's here. My boyfriend you, isn't here. Go look. He's not here! He's you, not here! So when the police you, come, they're you, gonna see that you're harassing me you, for no reason. You, they're gonna see, because when they search my apartment you, and they see he's not here, you, you're gonna be harassing me for no reason and I'm gonna I press took, charges. Took, took, Doesn't I, matter! I the picture when the he's pitch, running away, when he's running That was so away. long ago! When, when that was running, so long ago! That was so long so, ago! So that was he's days and months ago. He's not allowed to Since come in here. Since who? He's not here. He's not allowed to come in here. He's not here. here. Why he's, he's coming, not here. Why he's he's not coming here. here. When the police come and they check, here. they're going to see why, he's why, not here. Why? You're bothering see? me. You are bothering see? me because you want so me to my... leave. You're shut calling up. the police you on me because up. you want me to leave. I'm going to show them this. I will show them this. You're harassing me. Just show them. You just shut up, okay? You just shut up. You're harassing you know what? Your credit score, your everything in this country, you done. That's it. You Is know? That it? Your credit score, your everything. I give you court, you know? 
You are not paying rent. I gotta go to your social worker tomorrow. You you didn't pay for your last of two months payment. Your rent. You didn't do anything. We don't bother you. We don't do anything to you. And then you just make. You try to evict you're me. You're coming upstairs. You just knock the door like like. When like did I come like up there? there? Today? Just shut up. I just came here you an hour, two hours ago. Water. You just gave me really really hard time. When did I turn off the hot water? Shut up. I can't shut even up. control it. Shut up. We, we, we write Keep down going. everything for you. We write down so you're admitted you that you're what? harassing me no. because I won't you, leave. You Are, Can you of admit that? Gonna leave. I, mean, leave. Leave. I chose you, to leave. leave. I chose leave. to leave January 31st. Leave. What is your point? Leave. I chose to leave. You didn't make leave. me leave. Got, I chose to leave. Because you're couldn't even evict me because properly. At number five, you can see the exasperation written all over this manager's face as her probably new employee and probably in his early 20s employee. Not that I'm not in my early 20s, I am, but we have a propensity for immaturity that I'm quite aware of. Anyway, <laughs> this guy gets a little too handsy with the guy recording this video and has to be reined in by management. I want regular, right? How many times do I have to repeat myself? I already said it like two, three times. Are you incoherent? Are you like drunk on the influence of drugs? I'm, I'm telling you my answer like three freaking times, bro. Is your manager like, does she have many mental illnesses? Is she on the influence Yo, of drugs? Yo, shut the up. Shut the up. Yo. I'm not doing anything, dude. Why You're cursing at me? me. Yo, get You're out of the rest of me. You can't touch me. Hey, bro, don't touch me. I'm gonna call the police. You touch me, I'm gonna call the cops and I'm gonna arrest Sir, I just ordered something. Oh my god, this is so aggravating. Go in the back. You're recording? You, you, Ma'am, your employee is putting his hands on me. Can I order my food? Um, I'm recording you. I will make sure that everybody in this restaurant is fired. Your employee just put his hands on me. Uh, I'm trying my best here. I'm just I'm trying to good. order something. I got so far a four piece chicken. What I'm the so hell is going on? That. At number four, this auto paint shop in Escondido apparently held on to this man's car in the shop for three months waiting for them to finish. The manager, who the uploader mentions was wearing an ankle monitor, called police because of this confrontation and refused to release the car, telling police the uploader would have to take him to small claims court to get it back. That's fine, I'll move my car. You know, please do. It's a business. You cannot come here and harass us, take advantage Nobody's of harassing, nobody's yes, doing anything. Get the out of here, Dr. Your Dr. son, your hands on me. You're a f idiot. Yep. You're an idiot. John, you can't just, we're talking idiot, to you, bro. you can't just stand an up idiot. and paint. Uh, and he signed off on the color and he's upset now because he picked the color. Yeah, yeah. He's an idiot. Your color, boy. Your color and you. Get away from me, man. Nah, man, I'm not no, getting away from you. What are you gonna do? Me, man. Nah, man. I'm not. Get away from me. The no. Authorities already coming. Good. Let the authorities deal with me. Get away from me, man. Nah. Nah. You keep threatening me. Yeah. Threaten your you bro. Get yeah. out of here. Keep threatening me. You Get his piece of shit off my property. Yeah. You can't can't come here. Get out of my face. You can't Everyone come here and harass us every day. Yeah, move my car. You move your car. I'll move it. Move, move it. Get away from me, man. No, nah, man, this is my property, man. You're on my property. Get away from you me. You understand? Bro. Mom, get the f off of me. Get no, away this from is my me, property. Man. Get away You're on my property. Me, so I I need you to get away from here. I'm trying from to get here. to my car so I can okay? get my car then out of here. Hurry up and move. All right. Because I'm tired of you being here. All right. You're interrupting my operation. All right. You understand? Get out of the way. Don't get touch the, the car. Get the f out. Get the f out of here. What are get you going to do? What are you going to do? Well, we're getting down to the wire now, folks. At number three, we have this absolute rage fest between gamers. And you know, I spent a fair amount of time in Xbox Live lobbies during the Modern Warfare 2 era, but th this is just out of control.
And in our prestigious number two spot, absolute mayhem breaks out at this senior rally after a game of musical chairs gone awry. My lord, folks, this is crazy. But in the end, after all the carnage, everybody was just fine. Finally, folks, the moment you've all been eagerly anticipating. This woman, who is just the most Boston person I've ever seen, gets up in this guy's grill at a big game because he accidentally spilled either food or drink on her fur coat and her husband. And so she comes up to confront him and get in his face, and he is just a master class in calmness. Thanks so much for watching everybody, hope you enjoyed yourselves, be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and I will see you next time.